Okay, hello dear friends. Let's come back to the tea. And I was looking for the teapot and teacup and all these things take some time. And because we live in a small house and uh, there is no room to put everything out. So what I have done the other day when our school cleaning up our school has a uh, uh, renovation and did some cleaning up and uh, <clears throat> then I, we had a lot of box, used box so suddenly I was thinking if I put things in a box and in turns take it out every one month, two months, three months change it out then I can find something new and different. I think that's an idea. So you can hide something when something you do not have room, put it aside. And uh, a few months later, have a new patch. It's always like something new and uh, you have the excitement of opening up something new. That is, uh, that is a very, very, uh, very exciting experience. What do you think? So, this is what I am doing now. I pour some tea here. This is oolong tea. The other day, Chinese New Year party. We have invited some friends coming here to have a uh, uh, a dinner with us in our home so we uh, people drink wine champagne and uh, eat food and uh, people yeah we, we drank wine we drank champagne we ate food and uh, in the later part of the dinner some friends still drinking, uh, changing to different alcohol, different wine. And I think because I do not drink wine, so uh, I, I started to make some tea. And uh, I was very sorry. I told people, I'm sorry to disturb you, not disturb you. I'm sorry, it's, um, I would like to have some tea. Any of you would like to share some tea? And then uh, a few friends drank tea with me, and they found this tea very good. And it it uh, it is one of my favorite tea. And uh, I started to learn this tea when back twenty years ago, around twenty years ago, when I was doing business. When I was doing business in Shantou, in China, Guangdong province, and they have a very particular strong tea. And this is the tea, and uh, I had a student and their family from this place. So their family brought back some of this tea. It brings back all the good memories when I was doing business there. <laughs> so we signed a contract, a million dollar contract, a container, a, a whole ship of shipment, a whole vessel of shipment, not really a whole vessel, a, a, a few containers of uh, of shipment coming to from uh, all over the not all over the world from Europe mostly from Germany shipping to China anyway so this is uh, this is a tea I used to drink and uh, very strong very very strong and very internally strengthful but not so strong in color it has a very fragrant, very refined flavor of tea, but no artificial flavoring. There's no vanilla flavoring. There's no any infusion. It's the pure beauty of tea. So I like it very much. Oh, 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 oh. Some little uh, insects got thirsty. Also want to drink this tea. Please, this is my tea, not your tea. So, <clears throat> I like this tea. It's very, very enjoyable. It's a really good quality tea. Anyway, so we put this tea aside and we will chat about uh, 
the color blue today is all blue my clothes blue my clothing is blue and this inside clothing is also with blue flower bluish greenish and also today when I uh, let's come back to the outfit of the day when I said that um, today I wear blue and then I show the students even the glasses are blue they wear this is one of the blue glasses. Let me clean it up. I have bought uh, quite some glasses. The other day I was wearing glasses and uh, my friend came and uh, I was uh, reading and then I said, where is my glasses? Actually it's in my head and I was wearing the glasses in the head and asking for another glasses, <laughs> another pair of glasses. So then we were chatting about glasses, and uh, she said, "As we as we age, we change our collection. Different age have different interests of collection, and uh, as we age, we switch from uh, earrings into glasses. So the reading glasses, all kinds of reading glasses, I like." And they are not expensive. The other day I saw on the um, on one uh, magazine, or fashion magazine or something. They say, uh, yeah, it's uh, something you can afford. Brand you can afford a few hundred dollars. Gosh, if a few hundred dollars, I can buy the whole world the sun, the, the reading glasses. They are really not expensive, so I can afford whenever I see one. I buy one. Those things you use very often and uh, you put it everywhere. There is one or two in the toilet, one or two in the reading, in the kitchen, one or two in the bathroom, one or two in the in the bedroom, one or two in the school, one or two uh, in car, and one or two in where. Um, uh, uh, reading room, uh, library, and uh, anyway, you one one or two, a couple of in your pocket, a couple of in your um, in your um, handbag. You always need them. Look at it; it's pretty, right? Different kind of design, different kind of uh, color. Are we in the right zoom? I didn't wear glasses myself, so I cannot see. I have some more glasses and later I will... Sh you don't need to see them all, right? Another one. I like this one. It's quite cool design. They are all good. They are all good for its own goodness, right? Different kind of glasses, like the flower on it. You hear the sound, right? Another one. And this one is for green color. See? The green color clothing. And this one is for the... Oh, where did I get this one? Gosh, I, I do not recall. Oh, yes, this is a good one. This one is a good one. Also, so I use it very often. Another one. And this one is pretty cool also. It's pretty. Pretty, pretty. This one is pretty, pretty. Pretty, pretty. Yeah. Oh, the same one, almost, almost the same one, not, not exactly the same one. I think I, I, I wore this one to China when I went back to home and uh, my sister wore it and uh, she said, oh, it's so comfortable, so clear. So I, I, I give her a couple of pairs and so I think I can buy more and then send to home.
Oh, this is the same, almost the same. They are almost the same. I will not show you. Look at this one. <laughs> And I have a couple of the blue one. I don't need to show you them all, but uh, it makes me happy. It makes me happy, and uh, you always have some. And I think I remember when I first uh, heard about this story. That was um, that was my brother. I did not know at that time. China was very, very enclosed. Nobody knows much about outside the world and my brother was pretty cool he knew a lot of things and then he said um, there was a, a, a French president Pompidou and uh, it, at that time we did not speak any other languages only Chinese so uh, Pompidou is trans was translated into Pompidou and he said Pompidou had a lot of uh, pair of glasses he went uh, everywhere, and he had uh, a pair. There was one in the in the in the reading room. There was one in the in the bedroom or something. And we were thinking, "Gosh, that's so luxury!" At that time, my father, I remember, he had uh, I think only two pairs, one or two pairs. And every day he was looking here and there, everywhere, looking for for glasses. I remember what. At that time, I met one French friend through doing business, and uh, he was uh, 50, 60 years old, 60 years old, something. And then he was uh, looking for glasses, and every time he was looking gla for glasses, ooh, ooh, he flapped all the pocket, and then the glasses was actually on top of his head. <laughs> all these funny things. Funny little things. Ah, it is good. I am so happy. The, my story, my friend made a story about uh, um, glasses, and it's actually she told me it was inspired by seeing my glasses and. Uh, it was a wonderful story. There was one time the little boy was um, was just reading something, and uh, he heard a noise, and the noise said, uh, "Help me, help me, and uh, let me out." I think I I made the story also. I forgot how she told the story, but uh, anyway, we we developed the story, and then. He he searched around here and there, there and here, in and out, uh, up and down, left and right, uh, and uh, he searched around. Finally, he found there was some uh, noise from the basula, from the bubel, the the laji, the 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 trash, and then she, the little boy, took it out. Open the toilet. Uh, open the 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 trash and found a pair of glasses. And before he was tired and sleepy and could not see much things, with this pair of glasses, he could see everything so clear. Even the teeny tiny little little details. He can count his hair, how many hairs he had, and he can see in front of uh, the mirror. He can count his, um, his uh, eyebrow, and, um, and he can just, just 
he could do anything. And uh, this pair of glasses uh, told him, yeah, you should study hard. You should not be always so lazy and uh, fall asleep in the class. You should study hard. So he decided to study hard. And this pair of glasses, it's like a Google Glass, <laughs> could let, let the little boy see everything. Every time when he want to get some result, the glass will show him the result. So he became the best student in the class. He scored the best. He used to be the worst in the class. And, um, and then he became the best. And one day, the little... Uh, uh, one day... Uh, the this pair of glasses always tell him you should be the best you cannot let yourself be the worst you you have to do this have to do that have to do <laughs> so many 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 things he has to do so one day he thought i'm tired of you i do not want to be your glass i do not want to listen to you i want to be myself so he decided to throw it away so he threw the pair of glasses away and he became his himself he lived a, a life of freedom because he wanted to be himself then his uh, study become not as good he was happy but not as good so one day he he got uh, the school council talking to him oh Oh, Momo Lila. Oh, Minu, 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 Minu. Okay, so he got into, uh, he does not work hard and he got into trouble and the school uh, learning assistant came to, to him and uh, he was doing work with the learning assistant and then he raised his head, he found uh-oh, the learning assistant. That person had a pair of the same glass, exactly the same, only had different color. So, it's actually this pair of glass went to the learning assistant's hand, a face, and uh, this pair of glasses became the dictator of the learning assistant and then later on the learning assistant decided to change and then in it this pair of glasses went to different places so it's the adventure of this pair of glasses and uh, through people's different life it was a fun story i will not continue with it because uh, i think i will decide i will tell a different story the other day I was thinking, I had, uh, this story was inspiring. I wanted to make a story of my shoes. And once upon a time, there was a little girl. Her name is uh, Yang Yang. Yang Yang. Yang Yang uh, likes new shoes. And um, there are different kinds of shoes, of different color, different style. And each pair of shoes had uh, a character. And uh, whenever Yang Yang wears a different pair of shoes, it makes magic. It makes a huge change in Yang Yang's life. If Yang Yang wears uh, a black, flat pair of shoes, it was comfortable. Then Yang Yang was calm and comfortable. If Yang Yang wears a pair of high heel shoes, Yang Yang become orgueous, snobbish, and um, whatever. And if Yang Yang wears a pair of uh, red hot, high heel shoes then she will become so <coughs> you know you know what i'm talking about right and if yang yang wears a pair of uh, cotton uh, floral soft tender shoes yang yang becomes so 
da 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 da. Wow, that's good. I think it's time for me to pick up my keys. It is good to rewind myself. To rewind all of us in this wonderful time. Happy every day, calm every day. <laughs> oh, there is a pair of black and with degree so that I can read book. Under the sunshine, I remember sometimes when I sit outside, I would like to have some sunshine, and I would also like to read something. But the sunshine makes the make reading very uncomfortable. But with this pair of glasses, it makes my life much easier. Mm. And also, I think Kevin is on. Bye bye. It's time is up for this camp for this. Uh,